Oh man, it is good to be back in playing Modern Warfare 2. What's going on everybody? It's Lanes here. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're on Modern Warfare 2 because I absolutely miss playing this game. Uh, I'm going to say this right now. I am so ready for the next Call of Duty. Sadly, I'm, I'm having alright fun with Black Ops 4, but really I'm not as been playing it as much as I wanted to, you know? And, and like I feel like Call of Duty is starting to really, really just kind of bore me in a sense. And not there's not that much like there's a lot of content before like let's say Modern Warfare 2 didn't have as much content as of Black Ops 4 and Black Ops 3 with all the guns, all the crazy maps, you know, all the content that they add into the game. But at the same time, I don't know. Modern Warfare 2 still lets me come back in this game and I'll play for eight hours. A day on this game if I wanted to for a week especially modern warfare 3 especially I say black ops 1 and black ops 2 those games I could physically play for eight hours on a day that's when I that was like basically my peak I literally back in black ops 2 black ops 1 modern warfare 2 modern warfare 3 days those days I literally would, would play nine hours a day non-stop no like no stopping pretty much probably around the time i have to eat and i'll be sitting here all the time and that's just the crazy part you know that's the crazy part i absolutely love call of duty back in that those days it was just so much fun now it's just like i don't know like there's not been that much stuff that catches my eye in call of duty anymore aside sniping that's what makes me play this game every single day it's literally sniping and if modern warfare 4 comes out which is probably going to be the deal and if you guys want to watch my other video, I was talking about how it could be Ghost or Modern Warfare 4, but I'm going for Modern Warfare 4 because it's definitely going to do better for Activision and the whole community if it's Modern Warfare 4. So besides all that, you guys know about uh, Modern Warfare 2 Remastered. It's the 10th anniversary this year, so I'm there's going to be a no-doubt brainer that we're going to be getting Modern Warfare 2 Remastered, which means I am literally so stoked to play Modern Warfare 2 remastered because literally i like i love modern warfare 2 and i also love modern warfare 3 a lot of people like i know it's like the most sold game but there's a lot of people that would get mad at that game in general is just like rage inducing it i think by all means modern warfare if i had to say is the most reduced it like this rage inducing fucking call of duty but i loved it anyways it, like all my stuff that bullshit that goes on i still love the game no matter what and everybody would say the same thing to me and themselves that even though there was so much bullshit in games like this we still loved it you know we still loved it it still helped us a lot I'm, I'm like this year is my year i'm gonna be playing a whole bunch of games i was recently thinking for like the new year that was coming like i was like maybe i should try something new you know let's try um like maybe make like I would say like NBA videos, things like that. You know, I could get, I could start doing that. You know, that'd be a lot of fun. Like, am I, my, am I, I think I changed my settings because, like, why is it? Okay, yeah, I might have to like. There's the reason. I'm gonna have to change the movement. Hold on. Um, action. Hold. Here we go. There we go. Hold. There we go. That helps me out a lot. I cannot do with that. Hold, press, and then shoot. Like that just bothers me so much. You know. But there we go. We're, we're playing Modern Warfare 2. I'm going to be playing the living crap out of this when the release date comes out. Cause I still, I generally believe in my heart that Modern Warfare 2 Remaster is going to be coming out. And so is Modern Warfare 4. Simple as that. I really do not like this map. This is like the one map I did not like. But you remember. you you Like it's, it's a, something to say about Modern Warfare. Like Modern Warfare in general. Like it could be bad maps. But it's still like remembered as of a map. Like if you go on Ghost. Like, I cannot remember one map on the top of my head, you know, that I, I can name. I could probably think of a map, you know, specifically. I know a map on Ghost, but I don't know the name of it. Like, I believe. Was it, it's like, it started with an O. It's like one of the, like, my favorite maps I've played on Ghost, and I just don't remember the name. It started with an O. I know. It's just, you know, like, I remember every single map possible on this game. Like, like it's, it's pretty damn crazy, like. Side like Afghan quarry is like this rust guy. Oh my god, I can't talk. So, uh, uh, scrapyard, skid row, sub base. Like th these maps are like you remember every single one of them because you played. I literally played this game. So I would probably forget invasion. Really, like that would be the only one I would forget. Or uh, a state. Like those are like the only ones in my head that 
really would I would do not remember a lot in the game I say at the least so you know those are only two maps but if I have to say at the least I played this game so much I probably played it more than black ops 2 and that's pretty crazy that was like the game I played for four or five years straight like when all these games like ghost you know came out uh, and out uh, advanced warfare all of that I was still on the 360 I was still my 360 I don't even have it anymore like I'm I've been wanting to get a 360 back so I can go ahead and play it but unfortunately um, I don't have any live for that and I probably have to make a new account because I don't know my information anymore pretty much you know because uh, my old, old 360 is pretty much deleted and I don't remember any of my information on the 360 at all so I'm gonna have to make a whole new fucking account so you know that don't bother me really because you can easily go on the 360 on modern warfare 2 black ops 1 black ops 2 and find a damn modded lobby and b max rank like that you know that's not hard to do on 360 anymore it really is not all right guys this is going to be the last topic of the video i wanted to make this topic on new year's day but i didn't get a chance to do so and you guys probably already know what i'm going to talk about my goals my new year's resolution type of deal i really wanted to make a video and it was going to be very special in my eyes to make this topic for a Call of Duty video in general because 2019, I'm going to say right now for 2019, 2019 is going to be my year. I never said that. I literally never said that like my, like like 2018 or 2017, 2016. I never said this is going to be my year. I never said that. And this year is kind of like a special moment to realize gaming has been growing so fucking much at this point. And I just want to be that part of person to say, well, 2019, I grew so much in that year. And I'm going to say this right now. 2019 is going to be my year. I never said that, as I said before. And I'm I'm so confident in this year that I'm going to be grinding, making videos every single day, making the best quality videos I could possibly do. And I'm talking so damn fast, but I'm goddamn serious about this right now. This year is going to be my year. I'm going to say by the end of this year or end of, end of 2020, I can say I quit my job. And I can work and make videos for you guys every single day and just say I I made it. I, I did a lot, a very good job and I can finally like do my dream job. I can actually be a YouTuber and say that. That's like the general thought in my head 2019. I'll say that by the end of that 2019. I really want to say that by the end of 2019 that I said I made it. I can quit my job and I can work as a YouTuber full time. You know, that... That in my head, I really want to see. So my goals on 2019 is kind of like big in a sense for me. So I'm going to make this right now. I know this is kind of a low number in my head. Like I know I have like a crazy number in my head. But I'm going to put this number out there. Uh, 2019, I want to have at least 100,000 subscribers. And I know that's kind of crazy ass number. Like, you know, that's a crazy ass number for somebody with 95 subs, you know. But I've seen people and I believe that I can hit that number by the end of 2019 or probably even more because you guys know Hytale is coming out. Call of Duty, the new Call of Duty that I look forward to. My favorite, like my favorite development team, Infinity Ward. I believe in them this year that Modern Warfare 4 is going to be great and Modern Warfare 2 is going to be amazing for my channel and also Hytale as well. I'm making videos on that. Those three games alone I feel like I can grow and do so much with, you know, especially high tail because, you know, there's not been that many competitors for Minecraft and especially for somebody that has been playing Minecraft and those guys that made those servers and one of the most biggest servers of all time on Minecraft, no debate, makes their own game. I feel like they can top Minecraft the, the year it comes out. I believe there's going to be a beta probably in the next couple of months, so which means it's going to help me out the way I can go ahead and and full on make videos on Hytale and I'm going to be grinding living crap out of the next Call of Duty. I never, the last time, I said this every year, I said this every year, I said I'm going to grind out Black Ops 4, I'm going to make a lot of videos. But then when you realize by the end of the three month span, no one's watching it, no one likes it, you know. And like people like playing it, but like do they want to see videos on it? Like do they generally want to see video size, like, like videos that involve around news or topics, like. You know, that, that's the one thing that kind of sticks out in my head. Like, Fortnite is taking over gaming as of right now. And I'm trying to wait for a game where I can say I can grow off of. You know, Call of Duty right now. I love Call of Duty. Call of Duty is my game. Like, I, I never will ever switch games and say this game is better than Call of Duty. And, like, I can... People will kind of speculate, well, 
Fortnite's just taking over Call of Duty. It's just destroying it, you know? But, like, in my eyes, like, there's not been one impactful game, I cannot say, besides Call of Duty that impacts my life so fucking much. I've met every single one of my friends off of Call of Duty, and I thank Call of Duty for every single one of it. And I'm going to make it on YouTube because of Call of Duty, not for any other game. But, like, let's see if Hytale does. That's another game that kind of changed my life as well. Minecraft, you know, something like that that involves around that. I will make videos on that as well. It's just those two games in general just changed my life forever because minecraft i play at an early age and so that i did for call of duty and this i've made so many friends off of those two games alone so it's just something similar to minecraft comes out you know i mean playing it something like something like call of duty comes out i'm gonna play it i'm gonna have fun with it i just haven't had as much fun as i did maybe it's because i would say trick shotting generally trick shotting was the one that kind of blew me out the water that made me have so much fun like that and like that enjoyment as you hit that shot i know a lot of trick shotters out there when they for when they first hit their first shot or when they hit a crazy ass shot they like that that general that that motivation that comes out when you hit that shot it just blows your mind you know it just makes you even more motivated to do certain things and that's what it did for me that's what made call of duty so much fun to me because trick shotting was the one thing that made me so much happier so yeah 2019 is going to be my year i'm also going to talk about twitch you guys know i like my goal is not as big as of youtube but like because i really would like to stream every single day but i am completely going full on youtube mode this year i'm not stopping making a video like i know my job recently has been killing my like motivational type of deal because every single time i come home you guys know i feel like a complete sleepy wreck you know it's just at that point but i need to find a way in my head to force myself you don't need sleep you need to grind you know that type of deal i just haven't found that yet because every single time even high school i had that problem you know literally i had that problem i would play every single day but i would try to get more sleep and when i get home you know that's pretty much the deal but now because of work it's just i'm waking up at like four in the morning you know it's just it's not a very good healthy vibe for me but um i love the job it's a lot of fun i have a lot of fucking co-workers that is very good friends with me i this is awesome in there but i just want to have a job to where i say well i can do whatever i want in a sense that i enjoy the job i love and that's youtube like that's generally youtube making videos making content for people and just helping some one at least one person change their life you know that's one thing an extra go as well but anyways guys 2019 is going to be my year i'm gonna go ahead and stop talking because i believe i probably recorded for more than an hour of this video so um anyways guys that's pretty much the end of the video if you guys enjoyed this video i know i talk a lot a lot that's why people call me the talking wizard well i just made that up in my head that might be an emo you guys might see that but guys anyways that's pretty much the end of the video if you guys enjoyed this video 2019 is gonna be my year and i'm gonna make the best of it you guys know the deal but guys this has been lanes i'll see you guys next time peace out.